Welcome or welcome back at I need help at C squared. In this example, we need to find the area of the sector ABE and the area of the sector CDF, and we keep the answer in pi. And you notice here, I tell you the definition of the sector of our circle. This is sector ABE, and this is the sector CDF. So, how do I find the area of these two sectors? And if you notice also here, I said uh, the area of the sector is part of the area of the circle. So first thing you want to do is to find the area of the circle. So let's start with circle A and circle A. For finding the area, we're going to use the formula pi r squared. The radius is nothing else than 20. And 20 squared is 400, so the area of circle A is 400 pi. And now we can go and find the area of the sector. And for that reason, I'm going to look to this angle of 60 degree. 60 degree, which is the uh, central angle of this uh, sector, is one sixth of the whole circle, which is 360 degree, or 360 divided by 6. Six. So, and if you notice this pattern, then for finding the area of the sector, so the area of the sector AB, you don't have to use proportion. You just have to divide 400 pi by 6 or multiply by 1 sixth. And in this case, we can simplify both of them are even numbers, so we can simplify by 2. 400 divided by 2 is 200, so 200 pi. And 6 divided by 2, it's 3. So the area of the sector ABE is 200 pi over 3. And I will keep the answer in this format. Nothing else can be simplified. But now let's move to the second part, circle C. This one. If you notice, we have the same radius of 20 like this one. So circle C has the same area. which is 400 pi. And now we look into this angle, central angle of 72, 72 degrees. Okay, and um, we want to see uh, what should I divide by 360 to get 72? And what, should, what, I, what fraction I should multiply 360 to get 72? And that is 1 fifth or divide by 5. And if you notice this, then uh, the area of the sector will be very simple. Other than that, you have to use proportion. So the area of the sector CDF will be 400 pi, the area of the circle, divide by 5 or multiply by 1 fifth. And that will be 80 pi. So the area of the sector CDF is 80 pi. So you notice if you uh, have this type of angles uh, that go evenly in 360, you can move faster and find the area of the sector. Uh, if the angles are not friendly, you have to use this uh, proportion. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.